His name was Geralt of Rivia. He was a witcher, a professional monster slayer, an unusual contract to lift the curse that held a monarch's daughter. It was enough to spend the night with the princess, dusk till dawn. If only she were not a deadly beast, Striga, the traitor responsible for the curse, became the bait.
Witcher succeeded, lifted the curse, gained fame. The world changed with the coming of the Great War, the time of the sword and axe, the time of disdain. Geralt of Rivia disappeared, all but forgotten. But that's another story. The Northern Kingdoms nursed their wounds for five years after the Great War. Plague and famine raged, the death toll unknown. A few surviving elven and dwarven units sought refuge amidst forests, where they prepared for a final, desperate fight. Abominable beasts ruled backwoods, highways, and former battlefields alike. In cities and villages, folk were left wondering, what had happened to the witchers? The Blue Mountains in the north of Kedwin. The year, 1270. Five years after the Great War. friends, though you look like you just left your grave. I remember nothing. We'll speak soon enough. We're nearing Kaer Morin. Get Triss. Your time nears its end, witches. Enjoy things while you can. You missed the parry. I keep repeating this. Pirouette always followed by a back cross parry. Always. Barely two days have passed since they found you. Mm-hmm. I owe my recovery to you. Thank you, Triss. Remember anything? Not much. Look below. I know the moves. Pirouette, parry, cut. I 
can't explain it, but I feel a bond when we speak. I know you are important. Geralt, we... <gasps> Slowly at Kaer Morin. Ha! It worked! Not bad. Take a rest. What do you think, Geralt? Is he ready for the path? Wait for the rest. He's alone. The Professor promised 50 orans for every freak we kill. He's mine! Vesemir! We got company! I'm shutting the gates. Geralt, grab a sword off the training forms. They're trying to break down the gate! They won't get anywhere without a battering ram. Shit! What is that? A frightener. One mean beast. Savola. I know him. A mage as ambitious as he is insane. They're coming up here. Get ready! There's more! They're entering the upper courtyard! The one in glasses is the professor. Murder for hire. I sense magic. There's a sorcerer among them. Professor, you know the way. Get to it. It's a miracle you're alive. You could have told me about the stairs. Lambert and Eskel were supposed to fix them yesterday. We're not Masons. No matter. The Professor and the other mage must be hiding in the keep. Face the truth, Witchers. They're here to rob you. Trace, child, we have nothing of value. Some good steel, snow fox pelts. I mean the laboratory and you know it. Someone wants your famed mutagens. You're jumping to conclusions. Truce may be right. We need to find out what they want. One thing at a time. We shouldn't turn our backs on a strong mage leading a frightener. And you can't let the bandits in the lab. Right as usual, Triss. Geralt, you've dealt with mages. Find out what this one wants. Leo will guide you. The energy you annexed from the Circle of Elements is enough to stop the Witchers? You tremble, yet you complain Savola would have them all, leaving none for you. Did the sight of a single Witcher, White Wolf himself, instill fear? The aforementioned considered dead I might add is a known killer. I'll gladly challenge him. Leo, stand back. Come on, Professor. Time is essential. I wield the power of the Circle of Elements. They are no threat. Back to work. I want the mutagens ready for teleportation in 15 minutes. Our witches shan't trouble us. What did you learn? The bandits are in the lab, searching for something. 
The mage used the circle of elements to create a magic barrier. The plague! You're all children. Why didn't you mention the circle? Triss, child. It didn't seem important. If the mage aligned with the circle, he can create a stable portal through which he'll travel to anywhere on the continent, taking your equipment with him. All right, we made a mistake, but you said the mage was harmless. I said I didn't know him. I think we should protect the lab above all. Don't panic, Marigold. We know you'd like to see our witch's secrets. Vesemir, if that idiot doesn't shut it, I'll... Enough! Lambert, stop baiting Triss. Show her some respect. Triss, if we go to the lab, they'll have us surrounded. We know tactics. Maybe we should split up. Geralt's right. We need to protect the lab and kill the Frightener. Who goes where? Only I can break the barrier. I'm going inside. Vesemir? I'll stay and handle the Frightener and Savola. What about you, Geralt? We may both need your help. The lab is important. I'm going with Triss. Me too. It's decided then. Eskel and Lambert will stay with me. Savola just cast a spell. Something's happening. The ground is shaking. Feel it? They're breaking through. Defend the laboratory! I found it. We have what we came for. Professor, deal with those witches. I hear witches can parry bolts in flight. Smashed ribs, punctured lung. He's dying. He needs White Rufford's decoction. Hang on, Leo. It was here. I can't find it. Vesemir. Leo is dead. where the bandits came from or who's behind them. We'll draw attention if we venture out as a group. By splitting up, we can also cover more territory. I'll go west. I know a few people there, and I prefer the coastal Then climate. I'll head east to Kedwin, unless someone objects. That's fine. Which way should I go? South, to Tamaria. King Foltest owes you a debt of gratitude. Some time ago, you removed a curse from his daughter. You might happen on the bandits' trail there. And you, Triss? I'll try to use my influence to find the bandits. If I learn anything, I'll contact Geralt.
I'll gather what information I can and find you in Vizima. Triss. Don't, Geralt. I detest goodbyes. I'm liable to cry, and there's nothing more pathetic than a sorceress in tears. Don't get killed, Geralt. I don't think I could deal with that again. I'll see you soon. See you, Triss. too well what they're after. To use the stolen secrets, Salamandra needs equipment. Without it, the Witcher's mutagens are useless. They almost grabbed Kalkstein and his treasures. They almost succeeded at Kaer Morhen. Almost makes a huge difference. If I had stayed and fought the Frightener with Vesemir, I might have faced a different threat today. Vizima's temple quarter. Whores, murderers, beggars. Salamandra's base must be near. Sergeant, that Witcher's here. The one I told you about. Who do we have here, Mickle? Is this the man we want? Yes, sir, Sergeant, sir. It's that filthy freak, the Witcher. A blasphemer and a counterfeiter, do I guess well? Yes, he asked who's allowed into the city. Then came with that, uh, that letter of safe conduct from the Order. Well, if that's a knight of the Order, then I'm Princess Adder. Son of a bitch. Let me out of here, I'm innocent. Those five pounds of fist tech were for personal use. Hey, you, jailer, at least move me. I don't want to be with the politicals. Politics makes you rot. I'm a decent thief. Let me out. Such a trap. I'm busy. Jethro, keep it down. You looking to kill me? That thief's bugging me. Thief, right. And I'm here with the politicals. Scandalous. I said shut up! Stop screaming or on my mother's life I'll bloody smash your junky mouth! Absa fucking lootly beautiful. What's your problem, Whitey? You wanna dance to Vizeman? Come on, I wanna see your hands in the air. Jethro, open the cell. Ooh, scared. Soft as butter. Come on, Whitey. What you got? Back off. What? You want to fight or not? Professor, move it. You're free. How ironic. Our paths cross again. So near and yet so far. Fear not, Witcher. We'll meet again, I assure you. You're making a mistake. This man's a murderer. You fail to grasp the basic rules governing this world. You're a genetically modified murderer with no place in modern society. But we'll tend to that problem next time. Farewell. I can't wait.
the Witcher is taking his time. He must have left a different way. No matter. Seems true. I assume the trap is set? Indeed. Tend to your tasks in the trade quarter. I'll leave the matter to our best agent. Cut the crap and get him. You see, Witcher? Too much water around for Hazard to feel comfortable. Fire mage is limited. He needs me to do the wet work. Good. Two worms with one stone. Admirable fight. But duty calls us to the trade quarter. Contrary to popular opinion, chaos and terror do not spread on their own. The venom of Zeracanian scorpions, lethal even to mutants. Mistakes, Witcher. They can be deadly. Give my greetings to that young companion of yours. And now, have a nice time dying. I lost the skirmish in the swamp. Javed made off with the book. This marked the true beginning of our conflict. You're mistaken. I have him under control. And not just him. They're all leading out of my hand. I regret that Voltest is away at the summit, but I trust you'll tend to the King's Council. I assume you've resolved matters with Livarden as well. Yes. I made an offer and he accepted. He claims his superiors had similar plans, but we beat them to it. Men can do nothing but talk, and then always claim the initiative. And how is your Witcher? I should be able to convince him. Don't overdo it. Geralt can be exceptionally perceptive. I know. I must get back. I'll contact you when it's all over. Never let the Witcher guess what you hide from him. Should you be up? I'd rather make sure you've recovered completely. How? Don't worry. This won't hurt a bit. Well, you seem to be at full strength. It must be that unusual Witcher's metabolism. Triss, how did I get here? Pure coincidence. I was scanning for magic anomalies and happened upon a false trail set by Kalkstein. You found me in the swamp? What happened there? I don't know. The alchemist is still there, examining solid stone. But he won't find anything. The greater anomalies are here in Vizima. Magic anomalies in Vizima? Yes. I'd appreciate it if you could help me figure them out. But back to your health. I thought I was at full strength. You misunderstood me. Physically, nothing's wrong. It's your mind that worries me. Explain. You raved for hours. I had no choice but to read your thoughts to learn about your injuries and which poisons you took this time. I'm sure you read beyond that. I couldn't help it. Your thoughts were quite loud. In any case, I know about your recent adventures. Can you help me? Recover your memory? I doubt anyone can. But there's a small chance... A small chance of what? From what I saw, I think you would benefit by creating a stable personality. Meaning? Geralt, please, this is important. Just limit the psychobabble. You need to take a stand on the world's problems. It doesn't matter what position, just that you choose one. A strong identity may help restore your memory. Can't you just tell me what you saw? No, I don't want you turning into my vision of Geralt. I want you to decide for yourself who you are, without looking back. I shouldn't take an interest in the past? Exactly. Your memory should return in due course. We'll see. Geralt. You said something about magic anomalies. Various things can cause them, but more importantly, they can be the cause of true evil. When I last felt this way, you and a sorceress were trying to capture a genie, destroyed half a city in the process. You probably have no recollection, but a lot hung in the balance. I don't recall. I could use your help. I have some magic sensors that need to be placed around Vizima. They'll help us locate the anomaly source. All right. Give me the sensors. I'll take care of it. Always eager to please. 
What are friends for? Hmm. I saw a perfect wall cavity in the trade quarter near Town Hall. Place one there, a second in the temple quarter near the entrance to the sewers, and the third in Vizima's cemetery. We'll create a typical Radcliffe triangle. You know, of course, that triangulation is most effective in these cases. I'll see you later. See you. Just a moment. Hurry! Now to begin. Akayala Ambra Kur. We have picture. A blurry one. We may not connect with the Redanians today. Easy, the crystal's warming up. I'll boost the magical correlation. It worked! We have picture! I greet you. Greetings, sir. Enough formalities. What do you want? Our military bases around Vizima have been broken up. Spies from Nilfgaard may have played a part. So you're hip deep in manure. Why contact me? Sir, we're requesting financial assistance. Why would I help you? Our mutual acquaintances are working for people with close ties to you. You must think me mad. But, sir... You're in over your heads, all your experiments, fifth tech deals. I won't help you. Shh! Hear something? In the corridor! Slaughter. Here I feared those idiots would bore me with incessant pleas, but they proved entertaining after all. Who are you? Radovid. I don't like being interrupted. Listen, Radovid. I don't much care what you like. You'd better explain your connection to Salamandra. I'm sure we'll meet someday. <laughs> Nobody said that to me in a long time. I like you. You go straight for the jugular. I'll tell you who I am. I'm not out of fear. I share nothing in common with Salamandra, absolutely nothing. I once thought to use them as a tool, but I changed my mind. A tool? Political leverage, Witcher. Can you be clearer? I can, but I won't. Suffice to say that Salamandra's actions don't suit me right now, which makes us allies. Good luck, Witcher, and say hello to Ada. <laughs>
Geralt. You know me? Uh, it's me. It's me, Captain Vincent. This explains your disappearances at night. I was covering you. Those imbeciles didn't even crawl from the sewer. You want thanks? Just tell me what you learned. Radovid spoke to the salamanders through a teleprojection. The king of Redania? Some support? No, he refused, but they have mutual friends. Anything else? Nothing special. We're on the same side. Why should I spare you? <sighs> Why wouldn't you? You kill humans. How many have fallen by your sword? I'm not a monster on the inside, unlike you. You're right. Appearances don't matter. Thank you. Let us both be on our way. I let Vincent live. A deadly beast. A changing world. New, more dangerous monsters. Fistek. Slavery. Banditry unpunished. Werewolves are no longer the enemy. No longer the evil lurking in the dark. A dark avenger. Keeper of peace. The world's changing. And Vincent's a decent werewolf. Witcher. Listen, I found a magical stone at the Salamandra hideout. Interesting. Let me see. Geralt, it's a telecommunicator. It leaves a magical trace of any transfers. Use plain language. With a bit of luck, we can use this to find the Salamandra base. So? I need to speak with Luvarden. We'll talk later. Geralt, we were waiting. Greetings. I was worried. Decided anything? The Order is apparently willing to cooperate. We will rid Vizima of this evil once and for all. Misunderstandings do arise between different members of the Order, but I take it we're clear about what we're doing. Misunderstandings? No matter. Apparently we're to be magically transferred somewhere. Triss will teleport you and Siegfried to the Salamandra base. You'll open the gates for the knights. When? Still needs deciding. Quiet. I hear footsteps. Was I followed? The door is locked. Open up in the name of King Foltest and the Flaming Rose! It's the wet. Traitorous monk. A disgrace to our profession. I didn't foresee this problem. Siegfried! I know you're associating with that witch! You're finished! Triss, can you transfer us now? Is that wise? This may be our only chance. Akimbaga Hara! I knew this knight would turn to soup while being teleported. I'm counting to three! You're screwed, Siegfried! Soup? Maybe, uh... Dark Ambra Der Hadring! There's no time to lose. Siegfried? Open the gate and let the order inside. Where's Triss? She stayed behind to deal with that lunatic, DeWet. She told me to warn you that Azar has gained immense power thanks to some book. I know the story. Would you take on the entire base yourself? Any ideas? The Salamanders are using a magic portal to enter their base. Cursed elven magic. Can we use it? The sorceress said it is activated by a magic stone. There is something of the sort in the cave, to the right. White Wolf, we've been expecting you. I see we're all here. Good. We can resolve this. Ha! You've learned nothing from our last meeting. Even Siegfried of Dinell would follow you into fire. All is aligning with the grand plan. Should you demonstrate wisdom, you'll see it realized. What if I refuse? Witches are simple and sentimental. Don't make me laugh, Geralt. Simplicity suits you like a fist in the nose, and sentimentality suits you even less. You can't deny that. You're too smart. Besides, who do you want to defend? Faltest, a monarch with more sins on his conscience than the professor has long words in his vocabulary? Faltest impregnated his own sister and let his offspring eat the city's inhabitants for years. 
Furthermore, during the war, he allowed Nilfgaard to plunder and torch neighboring allied kingdoms. What's your point, Javed? If not Faltest, then who? The Lodge of Sorceresses? You know not what those bitches did to influence post-war treaties. The resettlements, deportations, the unresolved matter of the Scoia'tael and others. Your dazzling conclusion? Salamandre is not evil. Not more than those with the will to shape their own fate. If Salamandre is not evil incarnate, then what of Javed? Immorality, rape, murder, treason. What do you call this creature? The future, evolution, or destiny? Screw that future. I'd rather fight a nightmare, even if it's hopeless. Remember the magic book from the tower in the swamp. Observe some useful spells. Geralt! Are you well? What happened? What a blow. And a miracle you still live. I am... alive. Professor escaped, and the barrier blocks our path. I'll find him. You've triumphed. Go ahead. Your invaluable witch's treasure awaits. You have what you wanted. Show mercy. Never hurts to ask. So you can parry arrows in flight. I should have known you discover who was behind the counterfeit royal seals. I was wrong to see you merely as a monster slayer. The better you know me, the more impressive I become. Any chance you haven't deduced everything? Not much. I know you plan to stage a coup, assume power while your father is away. I also know you found an ally in Salamandra. 
My plans remain unchanged, and you won't stop me. I condemn you to death, sentenced to be carried out at once. Your Highness. Sorry, Geralt. The right of state never sleeps. As the condemned, I have the right to a last wish. One last kiss from you. A scandalous request. But the last wish is a sacred custom. So be it. You wish, Witcher. He has been spirited away. Someone will pay for this. This is madness! You should not expose yourself to such danger. Wait here, and allow me to summon a stronger force. Nonsense, Velarad. This is my city, the capital of my kingdom. Damn it, I rule this land, and I refuse to creep around its corners. Hey, gracious sire! Silence! You know you might as well wipe your ass with those intelligence reports. I want to see it with my own eyes. Humans attacking! Uh, protect the king! Turn, sire. I trust you are not too late. Your kingdom is in need. You should know kings are never late, Jacques. Sire, flames engulf half the city, and the blood of your subjects fills the gutters. This is no time for word games. You must act. What do you propose? Allow me to command your army, and the freedom to do as I see fit. Never. Over my dead body. It was close this time. Next time, I might arrive too late to help. I've seen enough. Velorad, back to the castle. What is he doing here? He dropped in. He seems to have a talent for that. What shall I do with him? He'll come with us. I have a matter to discuss with him. Witcher of Rivia. Sire, I am honored. As I'm sure you surmised, I have not summoned you here out of whim. A serious matter weighs upon us. A curse binds my daughter. I want you to remove it. I have gathered all who might offer aid. Duet has been the princess's adjutant for the past half year. Velarad has known Adder since her childhood. And Triss Merigold is here for her extensive knowledge of magic and female intuition. Mm -hmm. Consult them and think upon this matter. We shall speak about it again soon. As you wish, your highness. In the meantime, equally urgent issues demand our attention. I'm listening, sire. Witcher. Imagine returning home from an excursion against a monster, a Kikimor, for instance, only to discover your home a whorehouse. Your Highness. I'm not finished. Those you left in charge failed you. A traitor threatens to oust you from the home of your ancestors. Wouldn't you be angered? Would you not elect to shed more blood? Absolutely, sire. The non-humans must pay. With your backing, the Order... Unfortunately, the Knights have forgotten their place. They've developed a taste for power and want more. That is not something I can allow. You stood by while the Order's power increased. Perhaps you should negotiate with the Grand Master. And perhaps I should behead the Grand Master and his underlings. That would solve the problem. 
Sadly, it's not that simple. I'm certain you're right, sire. I must attend to some urgent matters. Speak with these excellent minds. Gain their insight. And don't forget my daughter, Witcher. I'm counting on you. I won't forget. My servant will summon you when I have more time. Geralt, I was worried about you. I worried too. I'm proud of you. Heard how you fought for Alvin. Horrible things are happening in Vizima. True, but the king has placed me under his, um, protection. Tell me, where's Alvin? Uh, Alvin vanished into thin air one day, despite the amulet I gave him. Vanished? That's awful. He might be anywhere in time and space. I had hoped the amulet would block those abilities. I hope he'll be all right. Triss, I've been thinking about us. Oh, Geralt. I love you. I want to be with you no matter what. Love is the sole thing of beauty in these rotten times. Geralt. I could change, take fewer risks. We'd find Alvin, live together. I'd build a house. A house? Nice dream. You could breed horses and sheep. I'd tend the garden, cook meals. We'd sell what we grew to buy copper pots, iron rakes. We'd age with dignity. Evenings you'd play bagpipes of your own making as a remedy for my gloom. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... Geralt, say something. I can't lose you. I'm here. These are trying times. We just need to survive. We can dream again when the madness passes. Triss, I... I love you too, Geralt. To the end of time. Witcher. Your Highness. No need for titles. Speak freely. You've had time to think. What's the prognosis on removing the curse from my daughter? It's possible. Could the curse have returned by itself? Unlikely. Someone must have cast it again. Should you succeed, would... Would Ada's mind be that of a child? I don't believe so. She'd likely recall all that occurred before her transformation. You don't believe so? You're not making this any easier, Geralt. Do what you can to remove the curse. Failing that, you may slay her without fear of retribution from me. When I last gave you my trust, you did not disappoint me. Thank you, sire. Don't thank me yet. Should you learn who cast the curse, tell me and only me. If you succeed, I'll grant your every wish within reason, of course. If you must slay her, do it quickly, cleanly. If you fail, and my daughter suffers, those dear to you will suffer too. I understand, sire. Good. Sire, another disease consumes your kingdom. What would that be, Witcher? I have been investigating an organization known as Salamandra. My daughter dealt with them, stupid girl. I regret I ever departed. To your credit, Venerad said you thinned their ranks considerably. I trust you shall finish the matter. Exactly my aim. One last matter, Witcher. Forgive me, but I had you followed. I received a report about your personal life. Your Highness? You must know that I hardly did this out of lewd curiosity. My spies report that you are romancing Merigold. I need to know if there is anything more to it. Triss and I, we're close. That's no one's business but ours. No need to be rude, Witcher. I, too, loved Adder's mother. They forbade me from marrying her. But I hope you fare better. At least as a mutant, you need not worry about pregnancy. If you desire to go to Vizima, talk to my Chamberlain. I shall be away from the castle for some time. See Velorad about any other needs. So I shall. Farewell, sire. Greetings, Witcher. I knew we would meet again sooner or later. Greetings, Rayla. Get your unit back? Yes. My reward for that elven slut. I told you I'd hunt her down. Teruvial? That's the one. Yavin's bitch. I handed her over to the boys, then we hung her. I've never seen anyone fight so fiercely. Decision time. A turning point. Stand aside or fight non-humans. 
I chose to fight. Neutrality gone. The skirmish at Murky Waters was the first of several victories for the Order. The uprising nears its end. I just hope the victory is not too costly. They say Yavin's gone wild. Chaos reigns in the Elven ranks. I see that. They're attacking without rhyme or reason. Try to keep up. We'll head to the field hospital in the center of Olvazima. I've already killed 20 Scoyatel. I wager you can't beat that. Any purpose to this excursion, apart from killing? Siegfried waits with important orders for me. Ready? Rayla, wait! fine warrior. May the eternal fire illuminate her soul. Amen. A great loss for the Order. I must inform the Grand Master. He was last seen near the Swamp Cemetery. I'm headed that way. We should go immediately. Witcher, I will write. You arrived just in time. I am Jacques de Aldersberg, Grand Master of the Order of the Flaming Rose. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. I have heard much about you and know of your deeds from a very trustworthy source. Explain, please. <laughs> Geralt of Rivia asking me for explanations. He who so generously lavishes his wisdom upon others. Forgive me for not laughing. I just didn't get the joke. I don't intend to explain. Unlike you, I'm one to act. I want to laugh when I recall your pseudo-philosophical reflections. Witcher, only time can teach us. Only with perspective can one understand what is right. Who is human? Who a monster? What is evil? And how to overcome it? I'm in no mood to guess. So why don't you just tell me what made you so bitter? Otherwise, we should part. Forgive me, I can get irritable. No, they sometimes tell me of your deeds. And though I don't approve of them all, I'm always genuinely interested to hear them. And how did I earn the interest of the Grand Master of the Order of the Flaming Rose? I like to know what goes on in Temeria. It helps me appear in the right place at the right time. Mm hmm Incidentally, thanks for your help. Though you're not human, Every knight's duty is to aid those in need. An element of our vocation. Sounds lovely. Do you know anything about the Order? The Order is an idea. From its foundations to its pinnacle. Our mission. Our vision. Our objective is a new world. A new order that will come after the White Frost. A world in which all will get what they merit. Not by birth or through connections. A world where the strong help the weak, and crime is duly punished. A world of clear principles and ideals. You must know, anyone can join, be they peasant, merchant, even witcher. Knights collect no payment, and are promoted for great deeds. That's an ideal worth fighting for. I shall remember those words. Siegfried, fall in. We need your strength and tactical wit. Yes, sir. Don't let me keep you, but I don't like to owe favors. You've paid your debt. I don't understand. You owe me nothing. Our rest is over. Fall in. Farewell. Greetings, Geralt. 
Faltes asked me to check on your progress. Trust is fundamental. True, but this particular monster is his daughter. Why are you here? Faltest well knows someone meddled with the curse. He cannot believe Ada turned into a beast by herself. The crypt may hide evidence. Faltest asks that you search the sarcophagus where the princess sleeps. Surrender any evidence you find. I'll fulfill the king's order. Now show me to the princess. Follow me. Where am I? Ada, you all right? What happened? It's over. You're well again. Geralt. Don't worry, you're safe. I'll take you home. Oh, my hands, they're covered in blood. I killed, murdered so many people. Oh. It wasn't your fault. Don't think about that. It's behind you. I remember, through a fog, it was important. I concealed something in the sarcophagus. You must see it. All right, I will. Hold me, Geralt. I feel so cold. It's this crypt. We should go. You'll feel better outside. And... Shutting me in that crypt. Nice gesture, Valorant. Sorry, which, uh, King's orders. The princess is freed. Ada, Valorant will take you home. Witcher, second time I underestimated you. Third time's a charm. Faltus gave me something for you in the event that you survived. This is the devil, a Zerikanian scimitar. The legends say it was tempered in dragon's blood. Someone induced the princess's transformation into a Striga. I have proof. Where? The king wanted to be the first to know. Fine. Is that all? The king said if you want to cure the disease, you must go to the old manor. He uh, said you would understand. I do. Farewell. Farewell, Witcher. Sire, victory. Despite heavy losses, we now control the trade quarter. Excellent. What news from De Wet? He's dead. Cut down by that godless butcher, the Witcher. Useless De Wet. Have the town criers informed the people Adder has become a Strigger? Yes. But the Witcher found the beast. Geralt of Rivia. Only he stands between me and... We must fan the flames of chaos. Release more of our experiments, and let the elves wreak havoc. Grandmaster, I must protest. As a nobleman and representative of... Enough. Give the people more food. And tell them any God-fearing human can find shelter at the castle of the Order of the Flaming Rose. Adalbert. I thank you for your loyal service. Take him away. A new era dawns. An era of superhumans. None will stop me. I appoint you my new adjutant. Know your assignment? Kill the Witcher. Then go. Geralt? You've arrived at a moment that should be called nothing short of historic. Dandelion, I'm glad you're alive too, but I have important matters. More important than a Temerian redaining alliance with far-reaching consequences? Stop being dramatic and tell me what's happening. In front of Siegfried? I thought the order was out of favor. This part of the order is on our side. Though the Grand Master violated his oath, not all knights have lost both mind and conscience. Foltest will be glad. Negotiations with Radovid are apparently going well, and it seems we're gaining another strong ally. We. Oui. When in Vizima, I'm a Temerian patriot. Let's speak with the king. He must learn the truth before he passes rash judgment on the order. Welcome, Witcher. Sire. We have several things to discuss. Of course. Stop deliberating, son. We need to put out the fire in this whorehouse. You'll get the princess's hand, and if life has taught me anything, half the kingdom as soon as I'm gone. As for de Aldersburg, we need to be rid of him. The Witcher will slay him. What? Relax, we'll pay you as much as you want. I'm a Witcher, not a hit. All right, 10,000. Isn't that a bit much? Come on, Foltest, the kingdom's worth a lot more than that. Yes, I suppose the boy's right. But you shall take home 8,000. 
It's a deal. So, we're all agreed. Radovid, your armies must subdue the Order in Redania and in the north of my lands. My armies will embark on a mission of fraternal assistance. I don't want any fucking fraternal assistance. The phrase rubs me the wrong way. You are to smash the Knights of the Order and withdraw. Relax, Voltest. My children will rule this land. I don't intend to destroy it. <clears throat> Forgive me, Your Majesties, but I feel it's time I... One more thing, Witcher. Yes? So, let's talk politics. And don't you dare mention neutrality. Judging by your company, you're already involved. Possibly up to your nose. Sire, your wish is my command. To the average pleb in the street, the Order is fighting my armies, but make no mistake. This is a confrontation between me and the Grand Master, that ambitious fanatic. Directed all of Salamandra's actions and intentionally provoked the uprising. What do you mean? I thought you'd be interested, sire. Very interested. That makes the Grand Master, him alone, the enemy. Is that clear? As day, the Grand Master, rather than the Order as a whole, is the Kingdom's enemy. And the Order need not be a foe. Led by someone sensible, it could be a friend to the people. It could be loyal to the King. Hear that, Siegfried? I do, and I understand. And I shall do everything to save the Order, my King. I knew you could be trusted. After your official investiture, visit me at the palace. We have much to discuss, Grandmaster. You count your wyverns before they hatch. Jacques de Aldersburg is alive and well. Sire, one other matter. Yes? How is Ada feeling? Much better than she was as a strigger, yet she won't be herself again for some time. Witcher, how can I thank you? I'm glad Ada is alive and well. Can you ensure that the Witcher's friends will be the same, sire? Yes, that's something I can promise. Witcher, I wish to know who was behind all this. Duet transformed the princess. How so? On Salamandra's orders. The bastard! If I could get my hands on him. Those responsible assumed your position would be undermined if the princess wreaked havoc as a strigger. Duet has been punished. I'm glad to hear it. Now go. Vizima is burning, fighting rages. You won't have an easy time of it. People see witchers as monster slayers. Rightly so. Few know we draw greater satisfaction from removing a curse or a spell. Swords are a final resort. As long as there was a chance I could save the princess, I had to try. It was worth it. Behold, my people. They feast at my table, find warmth at my fire, and glow with happiness to be separated from the turmoil of war. You're deluded if you think the sight of women and children will make me leave you alone. I do not intend to deceive you. The white frost approaches, a cataclysm that will bury the world beneath snow and ice. Each night, I dream of icy wastelands and the death of the old civilizations. I've heard Ithlina's prophecy. The cataclysm is unavoidable. Kings prefer to wage local wars to expand their influence. Elves have become terrorists fighting for a lost cause. The world needs a savior, a man of the moment, someone to kindle the flame in people's hearts. You, savior of the world. Come, I will show you something. Humans are weak, frail, and inclined toward evil. I shall create a new man, perfect, tempered in the eternal fire. Finished? Because if you are... You doubt me? I do not blame you. I had my doubts too. Yet now, my vision is strong. 
Behold, the scales will fall from your eyes, and you will understand. Juggler's tricks. I expected more. You think this an illusion? Oh no, Geralt, it's nothing of the sort. Where are we? See for yourself. Follow me. Now that you have seen the ice-encased towers of Vizima, do you understand? You're rambling, Da Aldersberg. What do you want? This is the future. The White Frost has destroyed human civilization. This is the end of time. Do we lose heart, surrender? Never. We can yet avoid our fate. Save your rhetoric for the plebs. Understand. The Order and Salamandra acted only to save humanity. Every criminal claims a higher cause. You lack humility. Time for a lesson in some. That sword is for monsters. You're awake, Geralt. I was getting worried. Dandelion? Where's the Grand Master? A few steps away. He's dead. For a minute there, I thought you were gone too. Hardly a pleasant nap. Was I out long? Well, you missed a few things. The Rebellion's been quelled, and Foltest has regained control of the city, with assistance from the Order. How's Siegfried? He was here a second ago, keeping an eye on you until I arrived. Then duty called. I wonder how he'll manage his Grand Master. Well, I hope. What about you? Did you succeed? Yes. I'll take the final element from Jacques and close this chapter. Jacques de Aldersburg's funeral drew masses. All wished to bid farewell to the man who had saved Vizima. The bloody street fighting ended. People saw the knights as heroes. Non-humans faced greater hatred than they did before the rebellion. The king's edicts punishing the Scoia'tael caused a mass exodus of elves and dwarves. History can, at times, be cruel. The king turned a blind eye to the iniquities of the Order of the Flaming Rose. The new Grand Master, Siegfried of Donnell, reformed the Order, consolidated its power. The sorceresses failed to consolidate theirs at the court of King Foltest. The king punished or exiled those who had plotted against him in his absence. New fortunes were made amidst the ruins. Some won, others lost. The natural order of things. Few knew what had really happened in those days in Vizima. They were those who destiny had brought together with Geralt of Rivia, yet they chose to remain silent. What then happened to the Witcher? That is a different tale entirely.
Samaria and Redania are allies, thanks in no small part to you. For your toil, a worthy pouch of gold. Your Highness. Master. Farewell, sir.